morning and welcome to Founders Metropolitan Community Church. This is our Tuesday evening Vespers. I hope that you are having a good week so far. We had such a wonderful weekend, such an amazing service on Saturday. Yes, we had Saturday service because we were involved in the uh, Christopher Street West LA Pride Parade on Sunday. Um, you may know a bit of the history of that parade is that Reverend Troy Perry, the founder of our denomination, also was one of the three men responsible for having the very first permitted pride parade in the entire world. Uh, in fact, the, with the three men that were doing it, the other two wanted to have a march, but Reverend Troy said, oh no, this is Hollywood, we gotta have a parade. And a parade's been happening since 1970, every year except for two years of COVID. Anyway, we had such a wonderful time in that parade and all of the pride festivities, and there are more pride festivities going on. And while we're all having such a good time and, um, and maybe excited and happy, um, I'm also aware that there are people that are not well among us. Um, I have several friends right now who are not well at all and seeking prayers for healing and so I just felt like tonight I should start with a healing song. And the song, um, I prayed for someone this morning who was not well. And as soon as we started praying, I immediately was transferred into a different, I mean, I know we live in the Spirit all the time. I know that the Holy Spirit is always there. But I was immediately transported into another realm, a heavenly realm that had to only be the Spirit. And I could just feel healing taking place in his body as we prayed. And I want to play this song so that if you need healing, for whether it's physical or mental, or emotional, uh, spiritual, financial, relational, if you need healing, there's healing in this place. And then I want to go into this, uh, an old hymn called Sweet Hour of Prayer. And um, because it was in that prayer that I was ushered into that that uh, sweet spiritual presence. And then, um, you know, part of prayer is our gratitude, just being thankful. A lot of times you can thank your way and praise your way out of a bad situation or out of an illness. I know that seems strange to be thanking God and praising God when you're not well, but um, I'm going to play, go into a song called 10,000 Years. We'll just get started, 10,000 Years and We've Just Begun, uh, to give God praise for all that God has been to us. And then um, end with a little bit faster song, but it's a song, again, about praise and thanks. The name of it's an old convention book. So Ernie, Viv, uh, if you're watching today and some of you other former Church of God folks or maybe current Church of God folks uh, will remember this song, I Just Can't Praise Him Enough.
Well, I just can't praise him enough. How about you? Well, I hope that brought a little bit of healing to your mind, your body, your spirit today. I hope that you have a good rest of the week. Um, lots of good things happening this week. The Bull Heights uh, Pride is this Saturday, along with Trans Pride is this whole weekend. And we'll be celebrating this Sunday, Father's Day, Trans Pride, and Juneteenth, all in one service. It's going to be uh, hard to get it all in there, but you, you watch us. You don't want to miss it. It's, it's going to be good. God bless you. Have a good, good week. Say good night, Fairfax. Good night.